Hello everyone. So we are starting a brand new course today. This time it is MS100, which is Microsoft 365 Identity and Services. Acquiring or passing both MS100 and MS101 can give you a title called Microsoft 365 Enterprise Administrator Expert. So after completing this course, I am gonna create a new course called MS101 so you can complete both to gain that title. In this lesson, I will give you a highlight on all the skills you need to learn for this particular course. I hope you enjoy this course and all the very best for your examination. All right, so let us start with lesson one. Lesson one, it's about the course introduction. In this lesson, I will make you understand what are the skills you need to have before appearing for the examination. So primarily, there are four modules in this lesson. Design and implement Microsoft 365 services, manage user identity and roles, manage access authentication, and plan Office 365 workloads and applications. On the right hand side, you can see the different weightages on this exam. The higher the weightage, that means you can expect more questions from these study areas. Now let's look at the course page. Just type in the examination number. The first search result returns is going to be for your examination page. This is the page where you can understand the details about this examination. And this is where you can come and register for this examination. As you can see, because it's not a fundamentals examination, you would be paying around $165 for this examination. MS100 examination is one part of this certification course. You need to complete MS100 and MS101 to achieve the title called Microsoft 365 Certified Enterprise Administrator Expert. Like I said, these are the four different high level skills needed for this certification. But what we are gonna see is what are the things we are gonna learn within those modules. So go to download exam skills outline and click on download. This will give you a PDF format. So within that PDF, you can come in and check what are the different topics you have to learn within these each module? So if you look at the first module, the first module is around designing and implementing Microsoft 365 services. Within that, we are gonna learn about planning the architecture for your Microsoft 365 environment, deploying a Microsoft 365 tenant. Within this, we are gonna learn about how do you manage your domain? How can you configure your organizational settings and things like that. So what I have done, I have broken down all of these topics into different, different lessons. So you can take your time to go through these topics one by one. And if you are familiar with any particular topic, you can skip that lesson and you can move on to the next one. After I complete creating the MS100 course, I will go and create MS101 as well. So you will be able to become the Microsoft 365 Enterprise Administrator. So that concludes the first lesson. In the next lesson, we're gonna learn about how can you plan your tenant in Microsoft 365. I will see you on the next one. Until then, take care.